Turning down to our top stories, the COVID-19 numbers are maintaining a steady downward turn in the Bahamas. The latest figures are showing 25 cases, with 10 of them in Grand Bahama, 9 in New Providence, 3 in Abaco, 2 in the Barry Islands, and 1 in Exuma. The new cases have been reported within 24 to 48 hours after swabbing. While with numbers down and decreasing hospitalization, health officials are being commended for their efforts in the local COVID fight. However, cases continue to surge in foreign countries like Europe and the United States. A number of Bahamians are still traveling during this pandemic. But once again, Prime Minister, the Most Honorable Dr. Hubert Menes, is strongly advising against no essential travel. If you get in a foreign country that is overwhelmed by COVID-19, it might be very difficult to get medical treatment. Additionally, as we saw in the first wave, when viral cases surge, countries may quickly change their travel policies. Borders could be shut suddenly, with no set time as to when they may reopen. Therefore, Mr. Speaker, the Yemen's traveling abroad, if international borders are shut suddenly, they can find themselves in a situation where they are trapped and cannot return. 